The next brand strategy in our toolbox is we want to protect our customer. This is a very important issue because customers will invite you into their home thinking that you're a safe person for them to trust, right? They're going to trust that you are an expert, but at the same time, they also want to feel like their opinion is valued. So if they give you a cleaning chemical and they ask you to clean a particular surface, and you know because you've done your homework that that particular cleaning solution cannot be used on that surface, you need to address that in a way that does not embarrass or shame the customer. Because if you make them feel bad or you make them feel stupid or you make them feel inferior, they're either going to fire you, but you know for a fact they're not going to recommend you to their friends and their neighbors. Nobody wants to recommend somebody that makes them feel stupid or inferior, right? It's very easy as house cleaners for us to get in this high and mighty attitude where we know it all and we go into our Facebook groups and we're pompous and arrogant and we have all the answers. When you get face to face with a customer, this is a chance and it's an opportunity and it's mandatory that you retain a little bit of humility. That when a customer explains something to you and they've seen an ad on TV and they bought something and they're super excited about it, you want to share their enthusiasm for that excitement without making them feel bad and just say, Hey, you know what? This looks like a great product. I saw the ads too, but before I use it, I want to make sure that I understand how to use it and what surfaces I can use it on safely. So before I just randomly use it today, would you mind if I go back to my office and I do a little bit of research and I read the safety data sheets and then I can find out exactly how I can best use this product and remain safe while using it because it's a product I'm unfamiliar with. And when you explain it in terms like that, your customer is going to go, oh, oh yeah, I didn't think about that, right? Now, both of you are back playing on the same level.